How did Athena's extraordinary birth defy Zeus and fate's prophecy? If you are interested in this type of videos before moving on to this story, you can like the video, subscribe to my channel, and leave a comment. Since the pictures are made via AI, their styles may differ. Enjoy watching. In the ancient realm of the Olympian gods, a prophecy whispered through the halls of Mount Olympus, foretelling a child who would surpass Zeus, the mighty king of the gods. Zeus, who had claimed his throne by overthrowing his own father, Cronus, was troubled by this prophecy. Determined to prevent it from coming to pass, Zeus turned his attention to Metis, the goddess of wisdom, and his first wife, who was pregnant with their child. The clever Zeus, fearing the power of his unborn offspring, devised a cunning plan. In a moment of tenderness, he embraced Metis and, in an unexpected twist, swallowed her whole, thus imprisoning her and the unborn child within himself. Zeus believed he had outsmarted fate. However, destiny cannot be so easily thwarted. Within the depths of Zeus, hidden from all, Metis began to craft a helmet and robe for her daughter. The constant hammering inside his head caused Zeus unbearable agony. None of the gods could provide relief, and Zeus's thunderous roars echoed through the heavens. Desperate for respite, Zeus sought the aid of Hephaestus, the god of fire and craftsmanship. Hephaestus, understanding the gravity of the situation, agreed to help. With a mighty strike of his axe, he cleaved Zeus's head open. This act, far from being destructive, was the key to a miraculous birth. From the split in Zeus's skull emerged Athena, goddess of wisdom, fully grown and clad in shimmering armor. She let out a powerful war cry, a sound so formidable that it caused the sea to ripple and the earth to shake. The gods watched in awe as Athena stepped out, her eyes reflecting a wisdom beyond her years, the wisdom of her mother Metis. Athena's birth was more than a physical emergence. It was the manifestation of a new kind of power. She was born not of the body, but of the mind, representing the victory of intelligence and thought over brute strength. Her armor and weapons, crafted in secrecy, were symbols of her strategic prowess in war, and her emergence from Zeus's head signified her divine right to counsel and guide. From that day forth, Athena held a place of honor among the gods. She was revered as the protector of cities, the patroness of arts and crafts, and above all, the embodiment of wisdom, strategy, and just warfare. Her birth was not just the arrival of a new deity, but the dawn of a new era, where wisdom and intellect were celebrated as the greatest of divine gifts.